Hey guys, it's Becky Brosette coming to you on day 26. Guys, we are four days away from finishing this program. And today, we have the pleasure of returning to MMA Speed. Now, I want you to think back to day one when you did this workout and you probably thought, oh crap, this is hard. Wow, am I ever gonna learn these moves? But we've been on a journey for the last 26 days and you've done much harder workouts and you've done a ton of push-ups. Right now is a really great time to look back to where you were when you started. How did you feel when you, were, when you started? Were you tired? Were you, maybe your endurance wasn't there. Maybe your strength wasn't there. And now you've come through this, this cycle of workouts and daily activity and core work and punching and kicking and your endurance has improved. I am sure that you did this workout today and thought, oh wow, this is much easier than it was on day one. Celebrate that because that's a win. Any improvements from day one to now need to be celebrated today. Are you more energetic? Are you sleeping better? Do your clothes fit better? Do you see some kind of definition maybe in your arms? Maybe you can do a move that you couldn't do on day one. That's progress. And through this journey, what I've been trying to implant in your brain is to remove the I can't um, language, to remove the, li the self-imposed limitations. And and then instead replace them with words of affirmations, of improvement, of celebratory language to help you see that this is not just a 30 day journey and then you go back to something else or you dump everything that you've done. This is just the first step into a lifetime of fitness. So celebrate your improvements today. Celebrate how far you've come. I don't I want to get away from the from weighing ourselves and celebrating weight loss. I rather celebrate the non-skill victories, the changes you've seen within yourself. Maybe you feel more confident. I want you to celebrate that. Yes, maybe your clothes feel looser and that's a true measure of weight loss and through the inches. So today take that time and pat yourself on the back for going through this whole journey, for drinking your Shakeology, for using your portion control containers, and for trusting the process and for trusting me. I appreciate each and every one of you, and I'm always here to help you through your lifetime fitness goals. But I just want you right now today to sit down and think what's next. You need to have a plan once this program the 30 days are done. Are you going to do another round? Are you going to do the hybrid schedule? Are you moving on to another program? If you're moving on to another program, I want you to think of a program that's going to challenge you. Pick something you haven't done before. Maybe Asylum, maybe Insanity Max, maybe 21 Day Fix Extreme, or P90X3, or Body Beast, some hammer and chisel, something that is going to test your body. You don't want to go back to like something that you feel comfort in. No, we're here to break the glass ceilings. We're here to shatter those self-imposed limitations. So I want you to start thinking about what you're gonna do next and I want you to let me know what that program is. I've done almost all of them so I know what they're like. Let me help you choose the program for you based on your goals. But now is the time to make that decision. Are you ready to go in for another round of quarter fours and then improve maybe those Sphinx blasters or to be able to do all the push-ups on your toes? Let's decide today because there's no time to waste. We don't want downtime where we can slip back into old habits. Fitness is for life. You want to stay young. You want to stay feeling good. You want to keep... Um, away from doctor's visits and medicines and feeling like crap and being sick, then you need to take care of yourself today. Your health is important. It's priority number one. Do it for yourself. Do it for your family. So guys, I hope that you see massive improvement today because I know I did. But let's keep celebrating and let's get ready to bring it on tomorrow. There's going to be a progression of the cardio workouts. Tomorrow's MMA shred. Then you're going to do power and we're going to end day 30 with... MMA plyo once again. Don't forget to do your abs and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care. Thank you.